At the Darabin Community and Kite Festival, they're not clowning around when it comes to access for people with disabilities. There are so many people in the community that have a form of a disability um, and really it's about making sure that everyone is welcome to attend the festival and making it easy as possible for everyone to come. It doesn't matter what background, what mobility issues you've got, you're welcome. The City of Darabin is committed to producing inclusive festivals and events. And in Darabin, people with a disability make up about 20% of the population. Festival coordinator Craig Rogers says it's not that hard to make an event accessible. He says it's all in the planning. Access needs to happen at the beginning of the planning process. It's not something you can add in at the last minute. Once it's being added in at the last minute, that's when mistakes happen and that's when it becomes much more problematic. If you think about access from day one, even when you're choosing the venue, then it makes life easy for everything and everyone. The venue for this festival has heaps of concrete paths to make it more accessible. But other things organisers can do include lay down matting where the paths don't reach, provide rest and recharge areas for electric wheelchairs, employ staff to cater for the needs of people with a disability and have sign language interpreters at stages and help desks. One of the attractions at this festival is Melbourne performer Asphyxia. She runs a sign singing workshop where everyone gets to have a go at learning Auslan or Australian Sign Language. For the workshop really it gives people the opportunity to learn some sign. It's a hands-on experience to take it on themselves and have a go. While I'm teaching the sign I, I include elements of deaf culture. So you know why does this sign look like this and how has it come about? So people can learn a lot more than strictly just that sign. Improved access benefits people of all abilities. From the elderly to mums, dads and their kids. You have lots of fun and the, you, you get to watch the kites and if you bring one you got to fly a kite. An accessible event isn't just about wheelchair ramps and accessible toilets. It's about going that one step further to make sure you have carers available on site. It's about making sure you have Auslan interpreters available that can be on call to assist anyone, not just on the stages. And it's also about making sure that you're making the festival accessible for performers and staff members with disabilities and encouraging those people to get involved in the planning stage of the festival and the artistic side of the festival as well. To take access a step further, the folks at Darabin Council who run this festival have started a mentoring program. The mentoring program is to invite people with a disability to get involved with the festival, to learn about what it is to have a festival and work on different aspects of the festival. Then working through to an employment opportunity and getting the confidence to build your skills up. Jason Ralston is an event runner who came up through the council's mentoring program and he's an advocate for people with disabilities. He says that inclusive events like this one can help challenge people's preconceptions. It's about becoming normal and if people are put into the general community people won't stop and stare and it gets to be normal rather than, oh there goes a person with a disability. So it's about breaking down barriers and about becoming more inclusive and people seeing other people just enjoying life as they do. People with disabilities are just another part of the community, you know. Like the new citizens that just arrived here this morning and, 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 and the kids and, you know, the local Indigenous people. And it doesn't matter, we're just, just another aspect of the community.
Brian Hender is the sound engineer employed at the dance tent here at the festival. It's everybody in the community basically at, at one event in one place, seeing uh, just the full diversity of, of the local community. So whatever your language, culture or ability may be, here at this festival, everyone is welcome to join the party. See you in the future. <laughs>